So we are out here teaching our children their civic duties that it is okay to protest so long as it is peaceful. And here we are in Vancouver letting the Canadian public know that Armenia has had extreme access to publishing false news. And so here we are at the Vancouver Art Gallery behind me with all of the Azerbaijanis that are here in Canada along with me, the <laughs> non-Azeri that is very supportive because my family is a part of this country and this nation that I have grown to love. And the world needs to know that Armenia is a terrorist state that is constantly attacking Azerbaijani people, their women, their children, their men. And two weeks ago, they killed 18 people for no reason, none whatsoever. They are occupying 20% of the land, which is Nagorno-Karabakh, or Nagorno-Karabakh for the Azeris. And we are here to educate the Vancouver population about that. So here we are with signs saying justice for Hojalu. We have all kinds of people here, along with, of course, the opposition. The freedom we have for our free speech, but we are here. Please raise the awareness. Azerbaijan is a small country, and unfortunately, because it's not very well known, not many people know the truth. And that is that they were once a Soviet country, and at the end of the communist government, Armenia went in, occupied territory, and then never gave it back. And in the meantime, they have been appealing to the EU, to the UN, all kinds of governments, even my own Canadian government, and lying, giving fake news, similar to that in the United States. Only here, finally, we've got a group that's going to educate the Canadian population and others around the world. That Azerbaijan is here, it exists, and all of the information that Armenia has been putting out is not real, it's fake. So please, look up Azerbaijan, look up Hojalu. That is a, one of the places, the other areas, Karabakh. These are our people, and we just want people to know about them. We want justice, so please look it up. Azerbaijan, we are here to stay, and we are going to educate. Stop Armenia Welcome to our world, Azerbaijan. So here we are at the Vancouver Art Gallery in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. And we are here protesting to let people know that there is another nation called Azerbaijan, or Azerbaijan, as most English speakers would say. And we're here to educate the Canadian public about this beautiful country and the wrongs that the Armenians have been doing against them. They have gone in, they are mortaring, bombing, sending snipers in and killing villages, people, little children, as young as my own, and it needs to stop. So here we are educating the Canadian public. So take a look. We are out educating everyone. Hi. Justice for Azerbaijan. That's what we're here for. All right, ladies, wave at people. Say hi. I'll keep posting later, but here we are protesting with the fake information that Armenia has been putting out in Canada. They are a terrorist group that is constantly attacking Azerbaijanis and their land. Two weeks ago, they killed 18 people. Previous to that, they are constantly using uh, their snipers and going against the ceasefire that we have in place as recognized by the UN. And so we are here to educate the Canadian public in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, that the information they have been given by the Armenians are obviously not true. So, 
If you're interested, take a look. Research, authored by John. Authored by John is spelled A-Z-E-R-B-A-I-J-A-N. And look up our lovely country and just take a look around in terms of the research. You'll see that most of the information put out, unfortunately, is by Armenians. They're not Azeri, so they're not going to be telling you the full truth. So remember, Azerbaijan. Bye.